Hey everyone, I'm here now to talk to you about the rest of Brave New World. Um, so for this video I am picking up with chapter 13 and um, I'll be talking about it from there. So uh, we have Lenina being more straightforward about how she feels about John. Um, she even admits that she loves him. And we know that John is also attracted to Lenina, but their versions of attraction and love for each other are different. Uh, in the world that Lenina lives in, um, sleeping together is basically the extent of that relationship. Whereas for John, it's a life together. It's a marriage and a family and being together forever. So Lenina's version of this is appalling to John, whereas John's version of this is appalling to Lenina. Um, so though they both care about each other, it doesn't really work out for them because of these differences that they have. Um, so in the midst of this revelation, I guess, between the two of them. Um, John is called to the hospital, and uh, while he's there, his mother is dying. Um, children are brought in for death conditioning because it's normal for people to just accept death for what it is and not really grieve. Um, so this, of course, upsets John because it's not something that he's used to. Um, so he ends up pushing one of the kids, but uh, in that chapter then his mother does end up passing away and John doesn't handle it well because, and you know, other people don't understand this because the relationship that John has with his mom is not something that they are brought up with. They are created in a Petri dish. They are not born. They don't have mothers and fathers and relationships, so they they can't. Um, you know, understand how he's feeling. Um, so kind of in turn to this, he sees uh, Soma being handed out to a group of Deltas, and this upsets him. He feels like everybody's just being controlled, and he doesn't understand why they're so okay with it. So he, like, gets up and he starts throwing the Soma out the window. Um, they call Bernard and Helmholtz to come and try to help. And uh, they all end up getting talked to by Mustafa Mond, the head honcho. Um, and he tells them that they're, they're being exiled. So they're going to be sent to an island. And the person who's most upset, upset of course, is Bernard. He is... And I know I talked about this before, where in the beginning he kind of seemed like he would be a rebel, and he, because he has a different mentality compared to everybody else, or most other people, I should say. Um, but he, like, once he gets John and he's, like, in charge of him, his outlook kind of changes because the attention on him changes. Um, so then he's, you know, he doesn't want to be exiled, he doesn't want to leave, he wants to stay here and try to fit in, I guess. Um, in these last few chapters, too, we also get a better understanding of why this world functions the way that it does. We understand, you know, uh, the Nine Years' War, which was a big turning point for them, and, um, you know, happiness and stability is the end-all and be-all of everything. Um, Consumerism is very important to them. That's basically how their society runs. They don't deal with anything old. That's why Shakespeare is no longer a thing. Um, they don't really, you know, learn about history because it, it doesn't matter. They don't do art, nothing beautiful, um, because things like that would make them think. And um, this isn't, you know, another reason they don't have families. They don't have relationships because sometimes those things can cause... Uh, pain and the whole point is to avoid that um, which is you know where Soma comes in 
um, Mustafa Mahdi <laughs> even makes the comparison of Soma to Christianity without tears because as he and John are kind of going back and forth about, you know, because John believes that God is important and that there is one and he views that differently than uh, they do in this world. Um, you know, he, he brings up all these points about like turning to God and working through problems and, you know, that all of that is a part of religion. Um, and, you know, Mustafa Man says, well, you know, why bother? What's the point when you could just take Soma and it makes you feel better? Um, so that's kind of where, uh, chapter 17 ends. And that's where this video is going to end because if you didn't read the last chapter, chapter 18 yet, I don't want to spoil it for you. I want you to, um, read that on your own and, and take it in and, you know, have your own opinion for the ending. But, uh, if you have any questions about anything I talked about today, let me know.